My name is Patrick White. I'm the Chief Medical Officer for BJC Hospice and Assistant Professor of Medicine at Washington University in St. Louis. Uh, my topic was the 13 most debated questions in using corticosteroids in patients with advanced cancer experiencing pain and nausea, what we do and what the evidence recommends. The key takeaways are in the last year we had an exciting meta-analysis that demonstrated that corticosteroids as an adjuvant pain therapy may reduce pain by up to 25% at one week. Um, so very exciting times for us. We also learned that dexamethasone is by far the most commonly prescribed corticosteroid for pain, um, but that there's a huge range in dosing from one to 200 milligrams. We found that eight milligrams total daily dose is the most commonly used, and the dosage is split pretty equally between providers either once or twice daily. Digging deeper into the evidence, we found that there may be a tiny bit of evidence that supports twice daily dosing as you may get a slightly higher treatment affect for the same dosage with no increase in toxicity. Um, we also found that a treatment duration of one to three weeks has the most evidence basis with really no evidence at all to support greater than three weeks. The final thoughts are we want to get even better data looking at these most common treatment dosages of four and eight milligrams to see what are the exact side effects and benefits to help you prescribe the, the best dose for your patients.